What's going on, my people? It is July 31st, 2023. August 1st is tomorrow. It'll be Christmas before you know it. Ah, it's time for the day's two-minute devotion from Billy Graham's Peace for Each Day. Living history. He is not here, but is risen. Luke 24 and 6. Why is it that the biographies of so many others are believed when they are written long after their deaths? Alexander the Great's biography, for instance, was written 400 years after he died. So its author obviously never knew him. But Alexander's legacy lives on while people doubt the life of Christ as documented by the gospel writers who walked with Jesus. Many people down through the centuries never had a record of their own births. Yet the existence of Jesus is revealed in the intricate genealogy recorded in the Bible that has stood the test of time. You, may, you will never meet Alexander the Great in this life because he is dead, but you can meet Jesus Christ in his life because he lives. The mark of his sacrifice on the cross are found in human hearts. Most gravestones bear the words, Here lie the remains of. But from Christ's tomb came the living words of an angel declaring, He is not here, but he is risen. Hallelujah. Jesus' tomb is history's only empty grave. Our question of the day is, why do you think it's so hard for some people to believe in the resurrection? Some people don't believe in the resurrection. Some people don't believe that he is returning, but I promise you that he is, and we must get ready. So for that, to get ready, we must be a blessing to others. We must be studying God's word, and we must be sharing the light and love of Christ out into this world that is lost and desperately seeking him. We, we need to feed them him every single day that we can. Thank you guys so much for listening. It's time to get bold. And we'll see you tomorrow.